Hello my classy people, TGIF, thank God it's Friday, we're going out shaking a leg on a holiday weekend here on the Jersey Shore, wishing each and every one of you a happy, happy 4th of, uh, 4th of July Independence Day here in the greatest country of them all for sure. Again, be safe and have a great, great time for sure. And of course, turn your closed captions on. And our tip sheets are available for both Woodbine and Churchill for Saturday. We haven't done Sundays or Mondays yet, but email me at speedking24 at yahoo.com. And I got my Ghost Zapper shirt on. Well, the old Nassau Stakes over there at Woodbine, up there north of the border, our friends up there in Canada. I tell you, they got four graded stake races. And race number eight is the Nassau Grade 2 stake race for 175000 on the lawn. Go on, one mile. For fillies and mares four years old and up, and I'm going to give you our top four picks in there because it's a full field of 11, as always, up there in Woodbine. Great racing, great value, very competitive, and I'm telling you, I love that racing up there. Wow. And we like the number eight horse, our first pick. Right? Because our flash drive. Save it on your flash drive. Well, this is the daughter of who? The legendary Ghost Zapper. Right? The greatest horse that's ever ran on a racetrack. This is the daughter of Ghost Zapper. Our flash drive. Three wins from nine starts. Two seconds for $252,000. This Florida bred, this four-year-old gal is on the back end by Dinoforma. Did you say Dinoforma? That's exactly right. This one loves to be on the lawn. And three wins from uh, nine starts is nothing horrible for our flash drive, the daughter of Ghost Zapper. Trained by Mark Cassie. And, of course, we got Patrick's husbands doing all the uh, riding in the in the saddle. We love that. And here's the thing. Eight to one on the daughter of Ghost Zapper, please. If she's a shade of her daddy, she'll crush this fill. I like this horse. This tremendous value. She does exit at grade three stakes, the uh, Bu uh, Gay Stakes over there at um, Belmont. Uh, on May 14th, a mile and 16, 150,000. Didn't disgrace. She ran second and third behind uh, Rugar, um, which is a Chad Brown runner. Now, this is a very, very nice horse. Our flash drive, I'm not just being a homer here, okay? You know, because it's Ghost Zapper. It just happens that it is Ghost Zapper, but this horse literally comes up tops in my handicap and one, two in my handicap. Okay, now she's hooking grade two horses up. They continue to step her up. It was some 49 days ago. I mean, this is her third race off of her three-year-old line. She's got 49 days since that last race on May 14th over at Belmont. Please. The added bonus is that she's the daughter of Goat Zappa. But this horse has no nothing to be ashamed of. This is a very, very nice horse. And at eight to one, I, I don't know how I get past that value. I got everything my way. I got a fine horse who had beautiful speed figure, a four-year-old returning off of a great three-year-old line, making her third uh, start as a four-year-old. She's trained by a top-notch uh, uh, trainer. She's got a, a, a Hall of Famer in my right, uh, Patrick Husbands in the arms, and it's the daughter of Ghost Zapper. I mean, and he's eight to one. I mean, this is an easy call for me. I mean, there's some nice horses in here. I'm not just saying she's going to walk and step away from these like that. But at 8-1, to one, I'm willing to give it a shot. My top pick, our flash drive, the number 8. Well, our second pick, well, you don't have to look far here, do you? I'm telling you right now, Plum Alley is in the race. That's right. It's the old uh, Dylan Davis is up from Belmont to ride up here north of the border. This is a very, very fast horse, obviously. It's Claude Clement, and I don't need to tell you nothing about Plum Alley, right? She can flat out run. And she's 9 to 2. So I don't know. Five wins from 13 starts, one second, one third, $733,000. It is Clement. Uh, Dylan Davis is up, uh, up from New York. The horse is very, very speedy and will be formally placed. By the way, come out of the same race that the number eight horse did our flash drive. Okay, but this one ran seven by six, but you know, she was going too fast on the front. So our second pick here is Plum Alley.
And our third pick, well, you ain't gonna look far either. It's the Lady Spigglespear. That's right, is that Emma Jane in the arms? Hey, Emma Jane's in the arms, and you got Rad, uh, Roger uh, Atfield doing all the conditioning and pushing the buttons in the control booth there, for sure. Four wins from nine starts. Let me see you shake a stick at the number two. You can't. The old lady horse. The number two is our third pick. This horse has every right. And I tell you, Emma Jane can ride with the best of them. I don't care what y'all say. All right? So the number two is our third pick in here for sure. Emma Jane don't need to take a backseat to nobody. All right? And then there is the number four horse, the old Crystal Cliff horse. This is another nice horse. So listen to this. The number four, I hate the odds, three to one. But the number four is a French bred horse. Three wins from eight starts, three seconds, two thirds. This horse in eight starts has never not hit the board. Three wins, three seconds. And the other two are thirds, right? Grand Motion is doing all the uh, conditioning and, and, and pushing in the control booth and Hernandez is in the arms. Speed figures are off the chain. This is a very nice race, as most races up in Woodbine are. They're large fields. They're very competitive. The odds are square. I mean, this is where we should move our tack to permanently, north of the border. I mean, they just do it right. I mean, again, you can't. You, just no way you can't find the horses that you like in here. And you get the price that you, if you're going to play your hard-earned money, at least you're getting value. If you're right, you're going to make some money. It ain't four and five horse fields. <laughs> but I tell you, this number four horse, Crystal Cliff, ain't no joke. So that's going to be our fourth pick in the Nassau States grade two. So there it is, y'all. Our top pick. You know it's the daughter of Ghost Sapper. Our flash drive. Put it in there. Download the money onto my wallet. Please. We love the number eight horse. We love it that it's eight to one. It is the daughter of Ghost Zapper. What more do I want? And my second pick is our other classy horse, Plum Alley, the number three. Our third pick is the Lady Speckle Spear. You know it's got Emma Jane up. And don't you sleep on the number four. That's right. That's a very, very crystal cliff. So, eight, three, two, four. But we're betting the eight to win, y'all. We like this horse a whole bunch. The daughter of our ghost zapper. Thanks. Having a bunch of fun. Enjoy your weekend, please. And most of all, be safe out there on the roads. And comment. Let us know what you think. And if you want our tip sheets, email us, speaking 24 Going out disco, and y'all. Have a great, great, great weekend. Have a great 4th of July. Independence Day.